what is happening. But the most important thing is that people still are interested in how they look. And you cannot separate cosmetic repair from reconstruction because many times reconstruction is cosmetic. And it's been a pleasure to be part of the plastic surgery scene for such a long time. And it's my fervent hope that I did a little something to put a little light on the subject in my career. And thank you. of uh, history of plastic surgery, people like Dr. Shireson and Crum were condemned by the legitimate plastic surgeons, um, seem to have benefited a lot from them in some ways because they were such brazen um, publicists of their own work, they really made plastic surgery uh, be synonymous with cosmetic surgery in the public's eye and all of the potential patients. And I'm wondering, you know, as history repeats itself, do you think that with uh, Dr. 90210 and Extreme Makeover, it's the same kind of situation going on today? Well, I, you know, you don't have to be a, a, a genius to recognize that unfortunately or fortunately for me, I was the prototype of Dr. 90210. And I did the Extreme Makeover. I did all of those things, and I, I'm not saying that I did it uh, as an innocent lamb. But the one thing that I always did, whenever...